Hey guys, Super G back with more The Suicide of Rachel Foster. And uh, I didn't catch this uh, just a minute ago. I was actually getting things set up. Uh, but he, uh, she and the gentleman on the phone, I can't remember his name, man, uh, just had a conversation. Uh, she said she could use a hot shower. And uh, he said you got to restart the furnace, uh, which is on the ground floor. Uh, which we just came from there. And I think I remember re remember where that was. So the boiler room. I, I think I remember where that was. So we're going to, we'll head, uh, we'll head downstairs and uh, start with that. Um, I, I love how everything seems so, you know, it's like, eh, you know, it's, it's not so bad. We got power, you know, we're somewhere safe, you know, nothing, ha nothing really happening, you know. I guarantee you at some point it's going to pop off and everything. What is this? I can't open. Can I open this? It's a storage room. Like what? What? What is? What is the significance of that? I don't know. But uh, yeah, I'm gonna play this game to to it uh, in its entirety, guys. Uh, I'm just trying to get my bearings around uh, around the game. Uh, I think we came this way one time before. I'm trying to get downstairs in the basement uh to do the furnace oh we could have came this way the other way um i remember we went to it in the last episode but it we couldn't interact with it so i'm guessing everything is kind of like on on an as needed basis you know let's see, keep to keep these doors open to kind of let me know where i've been uh we've been in there right I don't know. I don't know what that is. It doesn't look like anything important. Here is our dad's office. We can cut through here. Uh, come out of this office. Go back down through here. Oh. Irving. Are you at the furnace? He's waiting for me. He's down there. What? Uh, who? Old farting ghost. Wait. What did you say? Old farting. <laughs> I used to hide down there with hotel guest kids and wait for old farting ghosts to come and get us. Farting... the furnace? <laughs> I don't know yeah. if that's funny. When Leonard found out, he almost choked laughing. Your father laughed about stuff like that? Yeah. Well, that's long gone. Well, yeah. Farting ghosts. I'm not sure that that's meant to be funny. Uh, <laughs> who's that? Who's down here just eating it? Just eating out of a, a can for some beans. Chopped beef. What? Okay, let's see if we can turn this thing on. So we came here before. See, we couldn't interact with it before. So let's see. How's it going? It looks real complicated. Furnaces are all the same. Can you see the control panel? Uh, I guess. What does the pressure gauge read? Huh? The thing that looks like a clock. Looks this like... 100? 220? 220? Oh. I don't like the sound of... Oh. It should be more like 210 PSI. Pressure's building. You saying I have a choice between freezing or blowing up? <laughs> no. Push the green button. It's the starter. Old farting ghost, you rank spirit, wake up! Huh? Nothing, just talking to an old friend. <laughs> Get your life together, man, what are you doing? Okay, press the green button. Or push it. And here he is, in tip-top shape, I'd say. <laughs> You were right. The furnace is haunted. <laughs> uh, now you've got hot water. You have no idea how grateful I am. Just doing my job. So does that mean we're now we we're literally going to go take a shower now? Is is that what that means? Okay. Well, where exactly would we do that? Uh. I'll tell you what, though, let's, uh, ah, let's, what's in here? 
Okay, this was the laundry room. Is there water on the floor? I didn't come down here? Oh. What is this? I, I have no... I have no idea if I'm supposed to be even down here. Where this goes? Is this hopscotch on the... F what? Who's playing hopscotch down here? That makes no sense. What? Oh, wait a minute. What, what happened here? This old church? I mean, it's all, I know it's on the map. It's on the map. Uh, what floor? Yeah, we're in the church. Okay, I, we're gonna we're gonna make our way back to um, I guess to our room. Is that the furnace making all this noise? I I don't know. I don't know. I'm just uh just really curious to kind of get um the story moving along like right now everything seems to be calm and kosher you know nothing out of the ordinary uh as far as we can tell let's see where am i at now i feel like doing the, all of this exploring is going to benefit me later um in case i in case i do run into something that's going to cause me to have to run where am i now man To the ski room. There's chains on the door. Okay. All right, let's go back. Yeah, this is this is kind of good. I'm I'm to get familiar with with everything. Reception hall, boiler room. Okay, we need to go back this way. Um, we're gonna check this room right off of this small museum-like situation. Give me some good news. Uh, just letting you know that the rooms will heat up before the hallways. I just want to go to bed. Did you find a room you feel comfortable in? Yeah, my old room. It's exactly like I left it. Mm -hmm. Leonard cleaned it, but he didn't touch a thing. Same as you left it? Exactly. How does that make you feel? They teach psych classes at FEMA. Well, just being nice. It's endearing. But I'm not 16 anymore. There's lots of other rooms in the hotel. No. I think I'll sleep just fine. Okay. Uh, excuse me. What is this? Vandals. Oh, that's spray paint. That's paint. I thought that was, boy, I thought that was blood. I thought that was blood. I was about to say, like, we, we getting some, the first real... Uh, first real action here. Okay, it's just they just painted pig on the walls. Uh, we're gonna get there in a minute, guys. Right now, like I said, I'm just trying to get. This looks like a false door. Open, 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 open. Okay. Nothing in here. So this game must be like, I'm guessing like really linear, so to speak. Look, no mirrors. They they never put mirrors in games like this. They just never do. They don't want, I guess they don't ever want you to see yourself. There's some paintings that are missing. Some here. This place is huge, man. So is that like a dumb waiter or something? Is this a use? Oh yeah, we don't need to close it. It's fine. It's fine. Yeah, this place is huge, man. So I have... I'm not going down there. Uh, I have been in here. I've been in the kitchen. So this isn't new. Okay, we're back. Now we're back. We've been in here, too. Uh, it's the freezer. All right, let's go back over here. And let's head to our room. It's a dumb waiter hall thing. So we can go through here. Look at the weather out there. Look at that. All right, let's go upstairs. I kind of feel like we've gotten familiar with it somewhat. Now, he said something about checking the power 
upstairs. But I guess in the meantime, we'll we'll go ahead and go to our uh, to the bedroom and wait a minute. Oh, I took a wrong turn. Took a wrong turn. Let's go this way to the master suite. And here, Irving Crawford, FEMA. Hey. Hey. Listen, I just wanted to say, if I came across as obnoxious... No problemo. <laughs> I get it. It almost feels like I'm getting used to being here again. Whatever. Forget it, I'm beat, and I'm rambling. No, no. I... From the rumors that went around the valley about when you left the hotel, and all that rush, well... Right, I forgot. The Wilsonian mythology. Sorta. Now I'm just gonna chill in my room with the posters of my favorite bands, playing my old bass, totally unplugged. You play the bass? I suck. <laughs> I wanted to thank you. Knowing that I'm not alone here is a huge deal. Yeah, well, uh, thank you for um, listening and not freezing to death in your car. So I owe you my life, then. Wow. It's just... Your job. I know. Night. Night. So, how, how would exactly would we take a shower here? Even if we wanted to, you know? So, I'm guessing... Like, we turned the furnace on to do what? We just... To just to go to bed? Is that, is that what, we're, what we're going to do? We came back to the room. What? Why? Why? Why come? Why come in here? Uh, more floppy disks, but uh, there's no significance to them at all that I can see. Hey, it's a mixtape. That's what was in that. Uh, uh. We got some VHS. Man, what y'all know about VH, uh, VHS tapes, man? <laughs> oh man. So I, I'm, I'm not, I'm not exactly sure uh, what we're supposed to do here. Uh, let's see if there's anything on the to-do list. I'm dead tired. I'll sleep in my old room in the master's. Well, I'm in here, but how do I sleep? How, how, how do I sleep, guys? It, it's no. What? Okay, I'm not going to sleep in here, I'm sure. Right? How, how do I get her to go to sleep in her bed? I'm not getting a sign that says use at all. You know? Yeah, it's, I'm, not, I'm not able to get in the bed. So I'm not sure... I'm not sure what I'm supposed to do here. All right, guys, give me a minute. I'll figure it out. A little Left 4 Dead 2 for you. <laughs> Uh, what? How do we just wake up in the middle of this room here? Morning. Good morning, Nicole. <sighs> Get any sleep? Like a rock suddenly out Yeah, that's more like it. I was wide awake for hours. Then suddenly, darkness. <sighs> so, any news? Uh, uh, what? Are you snoozing? Irving, Nicole, stranded up here. You snoozing? After a night of incomplete crossword puzzles, I wish I was. <laughs> Wait, you didn't sleep? Like, at all? I thought you might need something and... But, I... You didn't go home? Because of me? I'm a workaholic. Okay. <laughs> so, uh, meteorologists are predicting a peak real soon, probably tonight. 
Uh, you can't move, not just yet. In theory, uh, what do you want to do? Uh, better off thinking about primary needs. I don't want to change the subject. Uh, let's stick with that. I'm hungry. I'm going to eat first, then I'll think about it. It's time for you to take a tour of the pantry. I could eat a horse. Deal. Huh? I could eat a horse right now. The baked beans will be scrumptious. Okay, so let me see. I'm I'm in the uh let's see fireplace kitchen dining room mezzanine hall offices. Search for food in the kitchen area. Okay, I think the kitchen is back here. The Bay of payphones. Uh, have I not been back here? Okay. This is my dad's office in here. Did we ever get access to the storage room? No. I don't think there's anything in here significant anyway. Okay. Like I said, I'm just, as I'm, as I'm going around, I'm just trying to get familiar with everything, guys. Uh, that's... Here we go. Nicole? Irving, uh, how long has it been since someone's inspected the pantry? Inspected? You mean stocked? I'd just like to know if I should choose between malnutrition and food poisoning. There'll be tons of things to eat. Hmm. Oh, definitely no mice or roaches. Pretty sure about that. I'm more concerned about the bacterial world. Uh, a mouse ain't my ideal. <laughs> Let's go with that. When I was growing up, I used to love chasing mice. Now they're gonna chase me. Uh, Moldy you'll see. food. There's nothing to worry about. I had an ant farm. <laughs> I wonder why. Why did it? Uh... Moldy food. There's some food, but it looks moldy. Weird. Yeah. I didn't expect that. Uh, there's a freezer. Take a look there. Okay. All right. I do remember there being a freezer. Where is it, though? Here. Here we go. There's... I don't... Oh, here. Wait. Here we go. To pick up. I grab... What the... Did someone... Close me in here. Hey, you kidding? Uh oh. Uh, I don't see any other way out of here either. What in the world? You just magically opened? Oh, uh, I almost forgot. There might be a problem with the fridge door. Just make sure it doesn't close. Are you close. fucking with me? No. Wait, what did I say? It would have been more useful to know that before I got locked in. Oh, holy shit. I'm a freaking space cadet. Yeah, I could have died in there. Can we use the microwave? Don't don't put the can of beans in the microwave. That metal's gonna. Oh Lord, ma'am. Well, ho hopefully the the metal. Uh -huh. <laughs> okay, can we? Can we? How long is it gonna take? We ready to eat? Looks like I can look around while that's that's going on. I said moldy food is in there. Uh, let me look at what the what the to-do list says. The microwave could be useful to heat the beans. Well, I already figured that out. I guess I'm going to have to use this thing more often. Is that good? Okay, awesome. Let's get this here food. Mug lunch. I love it. <laughs> Two-minute microwave. Well, we've gotten some vittles then, at least, if nothing else. 
Mug or lunch? <laughs> I love it, man. Uh huh. Sorry to interrupt your continental breakfast. Uh, I got a hold of Mr. Jenkins, the attorney. Okay. Uh, when's he getting here? I'm only taking good news. Let's go with that. I'm only taking good news today. Otherwise, let me eat. Up to you. Thought you'd like to know. Oh, come on. He called 911 after just a mile. I'll finish the inspection going to cry. Go to cry. I'm just going to hole up in my room and cry, if that's okay with you. <laughs> I can't imagine that. He asked me to give you a message. Okay. He says to... Hmm. This is a swear word, and you don't need to hear it. Uh, yeah. Uh, Nicole, at this point, start assessing the general conditions of the hotel on your own. Uh, jot down what you want to keep. I recommend you start with the second floor. It's surely the most damaged. Please. Okay. Only call me if you've got good news. All right, so we got to make our way back up to the second floor. I'm trying to remember how to get there. Let's go back this way. Oh, that's cool beans, man. She got she got her eat on, so I guess that's good. She had her uh uh what is it? What was it? Uh, lunch or mug or o mug lunch or something? Mug or lunch? I don't know. I'd have forgot that fast. I didn't go in here. Okay, this is a this is a nice little waiting area. Very good. All right, so we need to get up. Uh, Every suggests to inspect the second floor first. Uh, so we'll make our way around there. Uh, yes, this is where I want to be. We didn't open. Did we not open the doors to the ballroom? I thought I did. Okay, let me let me let me stay focused here, guys. Let me stay focused. Let's go up. Um, let's go up to the second floor. Uh, this is the to the first floor. This is to the... What is this down here? I'm so easily distracted, man. Okay, it's nothing. Can't really see that well. It's, I guess, I don't know if that's ice on the windows. Okay, we'll go up to the second floor. Okay. All right. So we can either go left or right. Can you guys get to, guess which way I'm going to go? I'm going to go left. That's right. I always go to the left. If I can go to the left. I can't. Oh, wait a minute. Does that say mold? Okay, we'll report the mold then. There's some serious water stains on the second floor. That floor is pretty run down. There's some windows missing and water damage too. Yeah. Wow. Okay, so we've, we've, we've reported the first issue. What's down here? I can't open any of these doors. Staff only. Hello? Did I hear a door open? Oh boy, this isn't good. Sealed door. Let's call that in. Here I am. Uh, what's up? The hallway on the second floor is cut off. The door to the west wing is locked. Your father started renovations, but he didn't get the bank loan and had to stop. Leonard's hmm. attic is at the end of the hallway. His man cave. Does that mean something to you? I tried so hard to forget about that room for years. Anyway, oh, man, uh, the West Wing is there. pretty run down after all this time with no windows. Hello? Are you there? You always have an answer to everything. <laughs> what do you mean? Tell me the truth. Tell me something. What are you hiding from me? I don't understand, Nicole. You know how to turn on the furnace. You know where to find food and that the fridge door is busted. You know my family's story and the hotels. It's up to FEMA to deliver the supplies to isolated places like the Timberline. I've been up there with the truck every month since I've been on duty. Is something wrong? How should I have known? How should I have known that, huh? I don't know. I don't know what you know and what you don't know. Uh, what difference does it make? None. I... I'm sorry if I upset you. No one can upset me. I better keep doing the inspection. 
All right. Uh, what is this? Guest room cleaning checklist. Okay. It's nothing, nothing really significant about that. Uh, another bathroom with a dirty mirror that we can't look into. Is that like, I, I wonder if that's like a, a, a thing amongst, uh, gaming, uh, producing, you know, producing companies. If, if, <laughs> if it's a thing to just to do that where you can't see yourself in the mirror, that's crazy to me. All right, let's open this door. Uh, what? Yeah. Hello? Who is this? What? Who the hell are you? Rachel is still there. Don't sell the hotel. Is this a joke? Who is this? Don't believe it, stupid. You're gonna pay for this lame-ass joke. I have a phone, a cell phone, I'm talking with FEMA, and I'm gonna get them to call the sheriff. Uh, what? How you gonna say Rachel is still here? Uh... Why, why aren't we calling him? I think we went that way last time. Let's go this way. Museum. Okay. Said so don't sell the hotel. Rachel is still here. You pissed at me? I've got a different problem. I don't have time to rehash my past with you. I've got a different problem. Someone just called the hotel. What? Who? It, it was a bad connection. W what did they want? They said, Rachel is alive. Don't sell the hotel. <sighs> Idiot. There's something else that doesn't make sense. The phone lines are down. Leonard stopped paying the bill months ago. I'll ask someone to run a check. Could you didn't do that? FEMA had FBI authority. Around these parts, time passes in a different way. Some stories seem like they've been forgotten, but... Actually, they just sink down. Sink down? Like tea leaves in a cup. Okay. I think I get it. Almost. That girl's death. Rachel. It was the result of painful events, and now it's someone's obsession. You talking about anyone in particular? Well, her death ruined two families that everyone looked up to. Yours and Rachel's. Your hmm. father, McGrath, the genius astrophysicist. And Rachel's father, the upstanding Reverend Foster, known all over the county. <laughs> Not something easy to forget around here. You know what I think? They can go get fucked, every one of them. I know what hmm. we went through. No one else. Fuck them. Wow, is that... That's how you really feel? Oh. My room. Old friend. Oh. Hey, cutie pie. Daddy. Cute. What? Nicole, it's Irving. Oh, <sighs> sorry. I haven't been sleeping like that. For Where are the sleeping pills in the these beans? Must have been sleeping pills in those beans. Since I've been here, it's like I'm literally hibernating. You had a tough day yesterday. I think I had a dream. About? My dad? Leonard, maybe. Okay, uh, I need you to pay attention though. Should I worry? The storm brought down some power lines. There are blackouts all over. Oh, great. The lights are weird. Actually, the lights are acting a little weird. <sighs> I was afraid of that. I don't like the idea of you up there on your own in the dark. We gotta do something. My electrical know-how is slightly limited. It's okay. I can guide you to the emergency generator. If we activate it, you'll be self-sufficient. Where's the hitch? Too easy. Where's the hitch? Uh, there are two ways of getting to the circuit breaker. Straight through the garage's side door, or from the floor you're on. But? The garage side door is stuck. 
you'll have to pass through the crawl space along the entire building and climb down from your floor. If the power goes out, you'll be completely in the dark. Oh, right. great! What do I have to do? Uh, check the closet in your father's apartment and see if he left anything you can use for lighting. Oh, on my way. I mean, short of this Polaroid camera. Any news? I found a Polaroid. Family photo? Anything important? No, I mean a camera. It looks like it works. You want to take a photo of the generator? No, you moron. I was thinking <laughs> of using the flash for lighting. Oh, smart. You can try. I had one just like this. I wonder who this belongs to. Let's go with this one. I had one just like this when I was 16. Leonard gave it to me. Maybe it's the same one. No way. I broke mine hiking on Hogback Mountain. I cried all day with Leonard insisting it was only an instrument used to capture images. He said, you keep the really important ones inside. Can't say he was wrong. Oh, yep. Anyway, the Polaroid's better than nothing. The light from the flash could come in handy. Well, it just may have to because, uh, yeah. So we can do, we can, we can activate the Polaroid camera by pressing the right directional button. Now, what I don't know is how often, how many times that will work. Ooh, we it's it's kind of dark. Uh, I think what I'm gonna do here though is take a break. Uh, when I come back, uh, I will play some more. Uh, the suicide of Rachel Foster, which I'm beginning to think. Ooh, boy, it's like legit storming outside. Look at the snow, man. That's what was that? See, I, I'm hearing things opening and closing. That's that's really weird. All right, guys, we'll take a break here. We come back. We'll play some more. Uh, this is it's starting to get interesting now uh, trying to figure out exactly what's going on around here um, I'd love for you guys to, to hang with me. We check this thing out uh, Do me a favor subscribe if you haven't already hit that bell notification until you know when more of this is on the way You guys take it easy. and I'll be back with more soon. I'll see you tomorrow later